I'm Joe with Reconyx. Today we're going to show you how to get started with your Hyperfire 2 cellular camera. After taking the camera out of the box, go ahead and attach your antenna assembly to the front of the camera, put in 12 AA lithium batteries and an SD card. On your phone, you'll want to download the Reconyx Connect app via the Apple App Store or the Google Play Store. Once you've downloaded the app and opened it up for the first time, you'll be given options to sign in. Depending on your phone, you'll have sign in with Google, sign in with Apple, or you can do sign in with email. If this is your first time with Reconyx and using the sign in with email, you'll see here that there's a create account button. Once you've successfully signed in or created your account, you'll be met with the terms and conditions of the Reconyx Connect app, as well as a question about allowing analytics within the application. Once you've answered those two questions, you'll be brought to this screen. Let's go ahead and tap Add a Camera to get started. It's going to tell us if this is the first time we've been in here. Let's go ahead and Next. Go ahead and enter in your name. It'll ask for your address information. Once that's entered, hit Next. Now you're ready to enter the serial number of your camera. You can either type this in manually or hit Scan Barcode. This will open up the camera on your phone. Simply point it at the QR code and it'll add that in. At this point, I'm going to go ahead and turn my camera on for the first time. Once the camera powers on, I'm going to select the image that matches the screen of the camera. In our case, it's set date. It's telling me to follow the setup instructions, and then when I get a device code, I'll enter that in. So on the camera, I'm going to set my date, set my time, my location's USA. We're located in Wisconsin. It's going to give you the option to enter in latitude and longitude. I'm going to skip this. Auto adjust for daylight savings. Temperature. My battery type is the Energizer Ultimate Lithium. Reconyx service is going to be my cell carrier. And then I'm met with Paracel to app. I'm going to use the arrow, change that to yes, hit OK. At this point, we're going to see the camera go through some cellular connections and eventually display a device code for us. There's my device code. I'm going to go ahead and tap in the app and I'm going to enter this. The app will capitalize these for you. Once I have the device code typed in here, I'm going to go ahead and hit next. And we're going to see a series of check marks in the app. We're also going to see some communication on the camera as well. I got a success message in the app. I got success on the camera. On the camera side, I'm going to go ahead and hit OK. It's going to stop our cellular connections. Bring me back to the main menu. At this point, I'm going to turn the camera off, set that aside. On the app, we're going to hit Next. You'll be brought to the Select Cell Plan page. Our default plan is our standard plan with pricing details seen below it. We also offer unlimited which is unlimited images, unlimited real-time access for $20 a month. I'm going to go ahead and select the unlimited plan and hit Next. It's going to load in, tell me what my current charge is for my first bill cycle. Hit the blue Add Payment method. Enter in your billing details here. And then you'll see green Add New Payment method. Once your credit card number has been entered, you'll see it down below here. Go ahead and hit Done. We're going to go back to the Activate Camera page, and then you'll see that the blue button changed to Pay and Activate Camera. Go ahead and tap on that. It's going to tell you how much we're going to charge, and it's asking you to verify your card security code one more time. Go ahead and enter that in. Hit the OK button. Got a success message. Going to go ahead and hit OK. It's going to bring me back to the camera details page for that camera that we've just added. And if I go back to my cameras page, you'll see that camera is added here as well. And you're ready to go. Now that we've completed the setup of the camera, it's ready to be put in the field. For any questions, reach out to our support department or visit Reconyx.com.